All right. Hello, friends and people from all around the world. I uh, want to start off by saying happy, happy holidays and Merry Christmas to everyone. Uh, we're doing great up in here. Uh, doing great in the house, great at the gym. I always have a plethora of problems, but we are thanking God in this house. We, we, we have so much more than most people have, and we are so thankful for it. Uh, and when I say so much more, we're not rich in dollars or pounds or pesos or Dutch marks. <coughs> we're rich in family. There's three of us here, me, my wife, and our son. Uh, our daughter's in Canada, but right now studying and working her fanny off. And uh, But we got family. And we're rich that way. Rich, rich, rich. And we got so much more than we need. And you're always filthy rich when you got more than is necessary. Uh, start thinking in those ways. It'll help you. Trust me. Uh, it's going to be a great weekend. It's about 7.38 here in the morning. I've been at it since five this morning uh, things going great uh, Joe's just started school and when he's done we'll hit the gym again and probably two more times and because he's in a wide open frame of mind and body at the moment so we're doing great around here. I want to talk a second about a video. I'm going to go back and try to find the video. If I can find it, I'll try to get a link down here in the uh, description box and, or pin it in the comment or both to a, to a video that I saw from the UK. I don't know if it was just recent this year, but it popped up on my stuff. I subscribed to the channel. Uh, guys, he's in a shopping mall in the United Kingdom or, uh, or in an airport. I don't know. I don't know the full background of the video, but all of you should go watch it. Every cotton picking one of you at some point during the day, come back to this video, go down there, hit the link. Cause I'm going to find the link to this video and post it. And, uh, Here's what it shows. Uh, again, I don't have the full context to it. Just going off of what I saw and heard in the video. Uh, a guy's in a shopping mall or in an airport. He's in a big place. Uh, and he's playing uh, what he's calling Christmas rock and roll on the piano. He's got a piano pulled in there. And he starts getting bum rushed by everybody from, from uh, Africans to Middle Easterners that should be bending down, kissing their own ass that they're even in the United Kingdom and not in the damn filth they left the hell up out of. Uh, and this could be the U.S. just as easy. And it is. And I, if I went and looked for videos, I'd, you'd find them. Uh, but this one was in the United Kingdom. Every one of these. All right. Uh, mal contented security guards. I'm going to try to watch my mouth on this one. And boy, is she about blue. Uh, they're over there. You need to stop this music. You need to, you know. And they're all in their foreign accents. And uh, you can tell <clears throat> it's Africa or every one of them are Africans or 
uh, West Asians, which would be Middle Easterners. And boy, they damn well don't want that Christmas going. They don't want it. Don't want it. Satan flew up in these in these damn men, and they're over there. You have to stop, and they're trying to shut the guy's thing. I was shocked, but it was well. No, I wasn't shocked. It was a normality, but I would have been shocked had I seen men being vocal for the guy that was playing the piano, but. There's a couple of women there were going, no, let this guy play. We all like this. Go mind your own. Just go mind your own. And uh, uh, there's a lot of people standing around the guy. Well, it ends up, you know, they're, what if we need the police over here? He need to stop this music. Blah, 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 blah. And uh, the police come over there and they come up with what I believe to be a cockamamie thing to do to save face for the foreign guards there and they tell him you need to turn the piano around the other side that's all he had to do and uh, he probably didn't even have to do that I see no necessity for that that's just dumb stuff and they were saying well your piano needs to be facing the crowd you cannot have your back to the patrons that are loving your music. So he turned it around. And lo and behold, the, one of the police ladies, they got on there with him and started double playing the piano with him. So it ended well, but it just goes to show in that little thing right there, what the hell's going on in this world. And uh, that never would have happened in the United Kingdom, Canada, the United States, uh, or, or Germany, or places like that, when I was a kid. Had something like that happen, and it got put on some type of video, or eight, it would have been 8 millimeter film back then. Uh, that would have been broadcast all over the world as... Look at these, these damn Scrooges. And it wouldn't have been tolerated. It wouldn't have been tolerated. And they would have been not so politely had their backsides booted back to the countries they come from. So it's interesting how the world's changed. And, you know, I always encourage people to stand up. Stand up for the right thing. Uh, these people, be they Hindu Muslim, Buddhist, Jewish, whatever their religion is, if they don't want to partake in Christmas, they need to take their ass somewhere else. Simple process, nothing complicated about it. It's exactly what they need to do. And uh, There's going to come a time in this world men or strong men are going to stand up. Trust me on this. History repeats itself. And here at this moment in time, that may be the end. It may be Armageddon, but it's going to come a day. Strong men are going to stand up, and crap like that's going to be kicked to the curb. It's going to be put in the dustbin of society. Uh, it's going to happen. So anyway, I want to tell people that story. I'm going to find the video. It'll be pinned in the comment section down here. And I just irrespective of your color, irrespective of your uh, religion or whatever with you, if, if you are a U.S. American or you're a United Kingdom citizen or North American citizen, when you see this, it's going to upset you. Because nobody likes outsiders coming in and just changing the game. Uh, well, there's, there are points where you do, but uh, if somebody comes in and it's a good game change, like uh, stopping stealing in your neighborhood or uh, stopping violence going on in the streets or knife fights or things like that, but... Uh, in general, people don't like this multicultural crap. 
this multicultural crap needs to stop. And it was brought about by one particular religion to tear all other religions down so they can rule. And boy, they, they're going to have a rude awakening here, I believe, in the next 10 or 20 years. Uh, people are getting sick of this mess and they're going to stand up and they're going to get rid of it along with the people. All right. Uh, the encouraging part was the police still right there at that particular point, right there at that particular spot, were jolly and appreciated Christmas music uh, and appreciated this time of the season. Uh, that could have been hit or miss. They are so lucky that cops didn't come in there and just literally take a, uh, a hatchet, uh, an axe to the piano. <laughs> so, all right, we're going to hop off of here. We'll be putting up some videos later on. There's going to be a lot of sparring going on tonight uh, or this afternoon. Uh, well, that's what you guys will see is the afternoon, the night portion you won't, but uh, the afternoon portion, I'm going to put some up of that with these guys going. Uh, I just believe in sparring the first, really the first day. I didn't do this with this new group, group of guys, but they just came in, but uh, uh, they're going to spar the, this afternoon, and uh, if any of them even come back, they may have had their fill of it yesterday. They may not be back, but uh, if they come back, they're going to spar. And uh, I'm sure it's not going to be real pretty, but uh, we'll do, when these guys spar, you see what they need to work on. You see what needs to happen and figure the weaknesses out. Again, you got to figure out, you know, you're going to be tough enough to handle this and you got to get punched in the face and the gut and whatnot to figure that part out. All right, I'm going to end this. Merry Christmas. Uh, we'll have some stuff out later today. Uh, again, I pray that each and every one of you have a tremendous, great Christmas, irrespective of what you have. My prayer is that you have peace and calm and goodness around you. Because if you got that, you, you, you've got more than you need. You've got so much more than, than you need if you have that. So blessings, everybody, and we'll talk to you later.